morning. Welcome back in. Hope everyone's well warm, safe and sound. Warm and dry this morning. Half past nine, 13th of April, in the alleged year of 2024. But I'm in 14 degrees down there in that London place, according to the screen. Happy Saturday. So, uh, for the last, this is the third day, uh, for the last two days, it's actually been dry. Um, just around about, well, literally eight, eight minutes ago. It's, it, it's trying, it's incoming, it's spitting, it's here, everybody in, everybody in. The spring's back, look. Spring's in the air again. Probably hear it now, it's gathering pace, right? Oh, just what we needed, a bit more water from the sky. Marvellous. Uh, got the glory, glory, the glory of uh, the Manchester Marathon tomorrow. Oh, well, won't that be fun? Where basically they block the whole road off uh, South Manchester for the whole day. So if you've planned anything to go see your relatives or emergency hospital trips or anything like that, you might as well just forget it. It's when the when the two councils actually work together and actually do something together for a change, rather than just being at loggerheads. You know, Manchester City Council and Trafford Borough Council actually work together. Close all the roads down. You got thousands of people chucking pl empty plastic water bottles onto the street, like, just expecting, you know, for the council to come and clear them all up. And, like, taxpayers' money, that. You have the council out double bubble on a Sunday as well, collecting plastic bottles that there's no need to be collecting them if there wasn't a, a marathon, a so-called fun run. Oh, yay. Yay, yay, yay. Oh. Well, it's a shame. Can we shut the road down to have a Formula One race? Can we shut the road down to have a rave? Can we shut the road down just to shut the road down, basically? No? Okay. They all started shouting at me last year, throwing water balls at me. So pleasant, so progressive. Just for saying, look, can't you go around, run around Heaton Park? Loads of parks in Manchester you could go run around. Instead of clogging up the roads that you're really technically not. Oh, won't that be fun? And just over yonder there, right? La -dee -da -dee -da. See that middle of the screen there? Uh, the apartments. Here I say, the apartment block complex. Right, well, just under that is the co-op. Oh, I say. Oh, I say. They've even built a co-op for you, I say. <laughs> a drummer that sits there underneath there, like that. Half past nine on a Sunday morning. Just what you want. Great. I've got a... F well, I've just had a funny feeling that like that. Just go and hide all the metal barriers. Don't, just, just go and hide them. Just put them places where they didn't expect them to be. Oh, someone nicked all your uh, metal barriers. What a shame. Someone took all the signs down. Oh, no. What a shame. What a shame. Oh, my heart bleeds. <laughs> like I say, can't you go around, run around Eaton Park? It's so annoying. Do a video on it tomorrow, like, the way they trap people in. Just can't get out. No matter which way you go, you can't get out. <coughs> Great. From, what is it? I think half seven to two o'clock in the afternoon. Great. Marvellous. But put, put a spanner in the works. Right. So if you're planning on going anywhere, 
forgot it. Anyhow. Hmm. It's trying, it's trying, but... A big freeze, eh? Like I was saying, you know, mini ice age and that. Global warming. Global. <laughs> oh, dear me. Anyway, this is my weather from the UK, South Manchester. No skizai. Incoming, inclement. Weather controlled, geo engineered, uh, programmable weather. You know? Get the general gist of things. Spring and summer. Spring into summer in Hume. Oh, what's not to like? <laughs> Take care, everybody. Have a nice day.